Hi everyone, this is Avonis Anastasiou and I'm the founder of Avonis Business Academy, an academy that provides approved and subsidized webinars and online courses on social media, internet marketing, SEO and many more. In this video, I'm going to explain to you what is Google Display Network. Well, Google Display Network is uh, one of the networks that you can advertise through the Google Ads platform. Google Display Network or GDN is a, is a collection of websites that accept Google Ads. So when you, let's say, when you want to advertise in a, a website that accepts Google Ads, all you have to do is that you have to create a campaign and target it to appear in the Google Display Network. The network contains more than 2 million websites worldwide, but your ads can be targeted to a specific location. So, what are the benefits of Google Display Network? If you advertise on Google Display Network, uh, you can showcase your product or services by using images or animated image. And therefore, you can brand your company, you can showcase your product and services, and you can attract more traffic to your website. So, it's a, it's a very good way if you want to boost the exposure of your company online, then you should start uh, using Google Display Network. Now, another major benefit of Google Display Network is that you can target your advertisements and choose the websites that you want your um, advertisements to be appear. One way to do it is through manual targeting where in manual targeting, you choose specific websites that you want your ads to appear. So if you're selling furniture, you can choose the websites, the portals that talk about furniture. So the visitors of that website uh, who are most likely interested about furniture are, are gonna be seeing your uh, advertisement. Now, another major benefit of Google Display Network is that no matter how many people see your ads, no matter how many impressions that you get, you pay nothing. You only pay when somebody is interested about your product and services and they click on your ad. So every time you set a campaign, uh, that you want to, to run on Google Display Network, you should always set them up so you pay uh, for PPC, uh, pay per click. You never set your ads to pay for impressions or CPM. So always remember that because it's very important. And, and the reason behind that is that the CTR, the click-through rate, which means the number of people that are going to click on your ad, it's only 0.5%. Yes, my friends, it's only 0.5%, uh, which means it's less than 1%. So why paying for all those impressions where you can get all those thousand impressions without paying anything and you pay only when someone is interested on your ad and they click on it, okay? So always remember that. So you get, a, so another major benefit is that you get a lot of free exposure through Google Display Network. Now, another way to target your, your ads is through automated targeting, which means you can choose the ads that you, uh, the websites that you want your ads to appear based on the interest of the users. So for example, um, if I'm interested, if while I'm searching uh, uh, Google or while I'm, uh, I'm, I'm browsing into different um, sites about sports, then the Google Display Network will understand I'm interested about sports or sportwear or whatever. So when I enter a website that, uh, you know, talks about any something else about the weather or, or anything else, I am going to see ads based on my interest. So if I'm interested about sportswear, then when I enter that specific weather page, I'm going to see ads based
based on my interest okay so i have a high inclination to click on the ad and go to the website but still the ctr is going to be only 0.5 percent now another person who's interested about let's say furniture when they enter a website about the weather they are going to see a, a google display network ad on furniture so because it's based on their interest okay so the automated uh, targeting is that you don't have to go and pick and choose the different websites that you want your ad to appear but your ads appear based on the interest of the people that they uh, visit that specific website um, so that's another way to target your ads another way to target your ads is through remarketing where uh, let me explain you how remarketing works let's say i visit uh, a website that sells furniture okay when i enter that website a cookie enters into my browser okay into my computer's browser so when i go and uh, I, I go to let's say financialtimes.com because i want to read the news about the economy and everything because uh, i have the cookie on my browser then i'm going to be seeing ads on furniture even though I'm, I'm 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 reading the news on financial times okay so remarketing it's a way to remarket your products and services based on your website visitors because if someone visit your website on the first place that means that they are interested about your product and services and with remarketing you can make your ads follow them for 30 days 60 days or even 90 days until <laughs> they decide to buy your product or service so that's about google display network i hope it was helpful don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel for more useful videos see you next